You're still lingering like the old cologne that you wore. I still see your face in the empty frame by the door. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I am so excited about this video. Yes, this is another reveal and yes, it is another collaboration with one of my dear friend, so is Ruan of the Yorkshire So Girl. We have been friends for a few years now. We met here via Instagram and YouTube and it's just been a blast knowing Ruan. I can't wait for the day that we actually meet in person because I think it'll be so fun. She's just an amazing seamstress as well as a YouTube <laughs> presence. You know, her her demeanor, her excitement, the funny things she says on her channel, they always get me so like choked up and cackling and I just love her personality. So as I've planned this year, I wanted to do a lot of collaboration. So Ruan had to be on that list. And for our project, we decided to go with the True Biases Calvin wrap dress. Now guys, this dress is really pretty. It's very simple. When I first saw the pattern, naturally, I for some reason assumed it was a knit fabric. However, that is not the case. It's made for woven. So let's jump in to this pattern review. Before I start talking, because I might talk a lot, I want to thank you for watching this video if you're coming from Ruan's channel. And for those of you that are subscribed to my channel and probably don't know Ruan, please head over to her channel and see all the content that she has on her channel. You guys, you won't be disappointed. You will get lots of laughs. She's just the most hilarious, heartwarming individual and I just love her channel. So links will be left down in the description for everything you guys need to know. So let's talk about this dress. Let's talk about the Calvin wrap top because I did not make the dress. I had all intention to make the dress but when you guys see the photos you'll realize that you might think it's a dress but it's actually a two-piece so first off the fabric guys this is the Balenciaga nylon woven fabric it was an error in purchase for some reason I thought it was just a regular woven linen and I don't know if I was just so excited about seeing them on sale that I chose the wrong one but I swear there was like a linen type material in this same print so i just i just took it i didn't even look any further um into the content for some reason it said woven and nylon it escaped me that it said woven nylon and when i shared this in my friday shows a few weeks ago um i was i was saying oh my gosh it's going to be a shower curtain it just i was a little disappointed and then after looking at it and just seeing the beauty of the print, I realized that, yeah, it could be a shower curtain. It could be highly flammable because it's nylon, so I have to be very careful where I'm walking. In the end, I was like, this is a really pretty print. Let me try to make it work for me, regardless of the fact that it's not the exact fabric that I wanted. It still is beautiful. So when I'm began talking to Ruan, I kind of thought that this fabric would really make a nice Calvin. It frays. <laughs> it frays like nobody's business. So the first thing you need to do is surge all your seams. That is what I did. I like to surge all my seams, especially when fabric are known to fray like nobody's business. So that's what I did and it really saved me in the end and I didn't lose a lot of my print just like falling away because they're just going their own way. I purchased this fabric from Mood. If it's still available, I will leave a link in the description below as to the Calvin and 
anything else that I mentioned that I'm that you may want to know about I'll leave the links down below so this pattern for the top has a five pieces so you have the front the back you have the facing for the underarm the neck band and the facing for the the wrap portions of this dress <laughs> mentally i keep wanting to make a dress so if i say dress in this anymore you guys know it's a top with that said I had no problems with this pattern. The only concern that I had, and I wasn't sure if I missed a beat when reading the instruction, or if I didn't turn on something when I was printing it, because the underarm facing, I mean the underarm band, it was so short, like it stopped like right here. There was no way that thing was going to like, cover like the next um, five inches so what I did I just doubled it up because I don't know I swear the pattern print did not say cut on fold and I'll show you so so here it is it says Calvin wrap dress and top armhole straps binding cut two on the main fabric and here it is so I don't know if I just did not like print the the note here for cut on fold but this thing would not work for me so once I realized that was the only issue that I had to deal with, I just decided, you know what, I'm gonna recut it and I'll cut a four piece, um, cut four pieces. I didn't have enough fabric to cut on a fold, so I had to like stitch it together to get the full length and then it worked really well. So that was the only issue I, I had with the pattern. Now on this pattern there is a, a dot where you can add a snap for safety for closure and I highly recommend that because guys this <laughs> there is nothing other than this tie here that is saving you from being all out there. And it's not the most um, bra friendly wrap like I just feel like because I wear a lot of mock wraps that this being 100% completely wrapped like it's like a bath towel I'm so conscious about that so having that snap there is a little comforting but I TMI I don't have any bra on and if you are really busty you may need to do some adjustments other than that I do love this pattern it came together so quickly and I can totally see making tons of this for like warmer months and cooler months if you do happen to make the wrap dress I would probably recommend wearing a, a turtleneck or a mock turtleneck um, long sleeve because that would look really cute because it will give you that sort of slip dress 90s style effect and that is one thing that I've never tried but I always think everyone looks so cute in them so let me know your thoughts do you think I would really do well with that 90s style with the white turtleneck and the slip dress I haven't tried that yet but it's on my wear list what to do so without any further ado, let's move into the 360. Now for the 360 and any of the photos that I share on Instagram, my regular uh, photographer is out of town for the next 10 days and Sophia, my 13 year old, has graciously stepped in to take pictures and do video recording. So it's not perfect and I'm just, you know, I'm letting her not feel too stressed about not knowing what to do because she got a little ruffled today because during the recording I had to keep coming back and you know 
giving her tips and telling her what buttons to do and how to zoom and stuff and she got a little bit nervous so if it does doesn't look like the typical recording and that's because we have a trainee on board for my recording over the next 10 days so let's take a look at this video here girl there ever was Annie darling you're so sweet and I'm so glad we had the chance to meet you caught my eye and you held my stare I haven't broken it yet for over 50 years thanks for letting me lay by your side and all those kisses every night wow when you're away do I miss you is it just because I can't kiss you is the dishes in the sink or the lack of a wink or just because I love my life with you we started ourselves a family the boys they came one two three and now they have little ones of their own and half okay friends so what do you think of the Calvin in this fabric on me I like it. I think it's going to look really great <laughs> with a jeans and a denim jacket or even a white cardigan and probably a short. That would look really nice. Now the skirt portion is the contona from Styler. All I did with that was um, cut the... Oh my god, what do I want to see? The first portion of that tiered for the condora, I just cut it in half and I folded it and I created a waistband and I'm going to step up, show you guys what the waistband looks like for this project. So here it is guys, so this is what I did. Um, this actually is the full width of this first tier here and then um, I just cut it and folded it in half so I cut one and folded it in half and then I went ahead and made a casing for each of the elastic to go through and there it is just some quick views so guys yeah what do you guys think of the Calvin on me I like the pattern I am not sure how I'm going to attack this in the future if I'm going to make it just because I feel like completely vulnerable with this top. Maybe I would feel a lot better if I actually had a bra <laughs> and felt secure but I don't know just having that tie is kind of scary to me so maybe I would put I don't know a snap somewhere on the side just for that extra security because it just feels like if anything happened I'm going to feel so ashamed but I do like this pattern I love how it came together and if you are wondering about the size this was a size 4 that I cut I didn't mention it earlier but that is it I I just I like the outfit it looks really good it's really fun um, I just need to work in the undergarment um, portion and find something that will make me feel more confident walking around with this top instead of feeling so nervous about it. I think now is a perfect time to let you guys go and check out Ruan's video. See what she made because I have no clue as to what she made. I don't know if it's a, a, um, a dress or a top or if she made multiple garments for this because it has been a while. We've been planning to post this video and I was the one that just didn't get um, the perfect timing set. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoy it. If you did, I would love for you to consider subscribing if you're coming from Ruan's channel. Thank you for taking time to check this video out. I hope that it was inspirational, motivational, and very informative for you. Until my next upload, guys, have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you guys real soon. Bye!
push you away and we're done just like that Something about you is pulling me back And I'm hoping